Cancers, what's going on? How are you guys doing? I want to welcome you all to your general love reading for April 12th of 2024. How are you guys feeling? I miss you guys. It's been a little minute since I saw y'all, but I hope all is well with you. I pray all is well with you, your loved ones and your pets. And I want to welcome you all to Miss Hawaii Tarot. So let's see what's going on, Cancers. What's happening in y'all love life? Winter season. I'm tired of being alone. I want someone who knows my worth. I love you. Ooh, I'm not giving up. I want you. Well, somebody loves you and doesn't want to give up on you and them. Father figure. This card keeps coming out. Caring, compassionate, loving, empathy, forgiving, and psychic. Card's been coming out a lot this week. Movie night, spending time together. I love being with you. We have so much fun. Some of you guys have Scorpio in your chart because a few of these came out for Scorpio. Confused, what did I do wrong? I don't know what I did or how to fix it. Somebody's confused when it comes to you and trickery fell out. Unjustifiable motives, trying to control you, manipulator, fake and pretending. And on the bottom, you got cycles. Keep going through the same thing. Wake up call, break the cycle, positive change. Let me light this stage. So there's somebody very confused about you and them, Cancer. Uh, I don't know if something happened between you and this person, but they, they're not sure what they did. If they did something to piss you off, they're confused. Um, you also got somebody here says movie night. So I don't know if you went on a date with someone or someone wants to go on a date with you and spend time with you. Excuse me for some of you. It could be the movies. You got winter season here. Some of y'all could be dealing with somebody born in the winter season. Tired of being alone. I want someone who knows my worth. Oh, that's confirmation from my oven. Some of y'all have been single since winter, since the winter time. You want someone. Hmm. This trickery card, you got to be careful. There could be somebody trying to manipulate you or some shit like that. So watch out for that. But it says cycles. You've gone through a lot of cycles here in love, Cancer. Um, but somebody does have a lot of love for you. Some of y'all, your father really loves you with that father figure. Like some of y'all, maybe you grew up with like a very strong father figure, whether it was your biological father or not. What else do we have for cancer? Some of you could actually be fathers, a few of you. Disrespect. Intimidating. Priority, somebody work at the mail, at the post office, UPS, FedEx. Somebody's name could be Frederick. New beginnings, non-monogamous, marriage, and trash. Ooh, some of y'all dealing with somebody that's straight up trash. <laughs> straight up trash, hefty bag. But you do got non-monogamous here and marriage. So I don't know. There could be somebody here who, I mean, some of you could be married. That's for a very small portion of you. But others of you, there's somebody that you're dealing with that's non-monogamous. They don't want to be with just one person. They don't want to be in a relationship. So watch out for that person. This person could be married themselves. I feel like a lot of you are manifesting marriage. There's somebody who's intimidated by you and there's somebody who feels disrespected by you. I just need to clarify a few of these to see what the fuck is going on. Let's see. What's this marriage card? Queen of Cups, Emperor, Judgment in Reverse. Oh, that's Backstreet Boys. 
Dun, 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 dun. Uh, let me tell you the story about the car that changed my destiny. I haven't heard this in a minute. End up in misery. Was about to go home when there she was standing in front of me. I said, hi. I got a little place nearby. Wanna go? <laughs> Someone's waiting for me. Listen, baby, I'm sorry. Just wanna tell you, no worry. I will be late. Don't stay up and wait for me. It's my song. I haven't heard this in a minute. Why is this playing? And I got it on a reggae station. My reggae station be tweaking. It be playing random songs like Backstreet Boys is not reggae. But I love them. Anyway, I'm sorry, cancer. Okay. Marriage. Judgment in reverse. Yeah, somebody, some of y'all, there's somebody married that's interested in you. Or some of y'all got feelings for somebody that's married or something like that. What's non-monogamous? Yeah, some of y'all stop talking to somebody. Oh, look, the devil. Oh, Jesus. Seven of Pentacles in reverse. Ah, could be a Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Stay away from this person that don't want a relationship, don't want, they don't want to commit to nobody. This person just want to fuck with the devil. They toxic. Stay away from them. I mean, unless you okay with that. But if you know you want a husband, a wife, girlfriend, boyfriend, this is not the person to deal with. Who's the disrespect card? What's that about? The star in reverse. Nine of Pentacles, six. Of, somebody from your past feels like you disrespected them. Some of you is an Aquarius. Let me tell you the story about the call that changed my destiny. There's something about a call here. Let me know if that resonates. Because that's the song that's playing by Backstreet Boys. The call. I got a little place nearby. Somebody feels disrespected by you. All it's telling me is that it's somebody from the past who feels like you didn't believe in the connection. They feel like you wanted to be single. Who feels intimidated by you? Oh, some of y'all, somebody stopped talking to you suddenly. It's because this person was intimidated by you. What you got going for yourself, how you look. You might have thought something was going really well with this, with somebody, you know what I mean, with this person here. And then all of a sudden they just stopped talking to you. This person, eight of swords. I don't know, I just heard jealous of you. Some of you cancers are doing really good for yourself. You could be business owners. You could be very financially stable, very smart. You could just be on a really right track for your age, where you're going, everything you've accomplished. And it intimidated somebody. So if somebody just suddenly stopped talking to you all of a sudden out of nowhere, because this person was intimidated by you, your attractiveness, what you have going on, fuck them. No, for real. Because we ain't got time for intimidation. What's the priority card? Grow up. You know, there are some people who like people who aren't doing that well. Because they feel like they have less respect for themselves. So somebody who, you know what I mean, ain't got shit going on for themselves. Some people like people like that because they feel like they're more vulnerable. They can, they can, that's somebody they can take and they can, they can act however they want to act because this person don't have shit going for themselves. Whereas if you know somebody do got shit going for themselves, they're not going to put up with your shit because they know they can do better. You'll be amazed at the way some people think y'all. New beginnings. I see a new beginning. Oh, no, we're on priority. Knight of Swords, Hierophant in reverse. Some of y'all. Excuse me. Some of y'all. Sorry, I had something to drink before I started the reading. That's why I keep burping. I'm sorry about that. I know that's gross, but I'm a human being and it happens sometimes. Hierophant in reverse, the Knight of Swords. Some of y'all, there's somebody you broke up with or you separated from. Some of y'all even divorced, but this person still puts you on a pedestal. If you hit this person up right now and said, I need you, they will be right there at the door. 
this is somebody you either divorced or you broke up with, but this person, you're still top priority to this person. Whereas if you call them, if you need them, they will be right there for you. Some of y'all could be born on the second, heavy second energy, uh, the 20th, the 15th, the 1st. Listen, baby, I'm sorry. Just want to tell you no worries. <laughs> Y'all like this bitch crazy. <laughs> That's why you love me. Uh -uh. Let's go into the tarot. <laughs> What's happening in Cancer's love life right now? <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! I'm in a little bit of a good mood. A little bit of a good mood. Listen, baby, I'm sorry. I'm not really excited about my dinner. I just saw 11 11 on the clock, so that's definitely an angel number message for you. I'm having fish, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to be healthy with carrots and broccoli and shit. I'm not super excited about it, but mm. what y'all having for dinner? Let me know in the comments. Y'all be having some fun shit for dinner. Y'all be putting me on with shit y'all be having for dinner. I'd be like, oh, I got to try that. <laughs> What's going on with my cancers in love? Now listen, baby, I'm sorry. Some of y'all, I don't know, this is random. Some of y'all, you loan somebody some money. You're not getting that money back. I don't know if they keep stalling, telling you you're going to get it. They're going to give it to you. <laughs> but you're not getting that money back. But don't even, don't even like fret over that shit. Because you did a good thing. You did a good deed. This person. Don't even worry. It could be a family member, a friend, co-worker. I just saw 12-12 on the clock. You got a lot of major arcanas. Death. Sun in reverse, world, high priestess in reverse, empress in reverse, temperance. You literally got six major arcanas back to back. The bottom is the queen of cups in reverse. Some of y'all have emotionally detached from somebody. Some of you cancers, I don't know who this is for. Somebody's baby mother, somebody's mother, baby daddy, daddy don't can't stand you. I don't know what that's about. I don't know if this is somebody new you're dating and they have a child with someone and they know about you and this person hates you or this is the person you're dating, their mother, their father don't like you. We're going to clarify that. Uh, do, 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 you got the death card, transformation, six of pentacles in reverse, the sun in reverse, the world. You definitely close out some type of major cycle in your love life. Some of you completely detached from somebody emotionally. Somebody got their period. You could have got it today or yesterday or some shit. Somebody's name could be Trisha. Monty. I heard Monty very strongly. Ronaldo. Leonard. Shamor. Shamar. Shamia. Shamia. What's the Six of Pentacles in reverse? The Knight of Swords, the Wheel of Fortune in reverse, the Hangman in reverse. Some of you Cancers, you tired of dealing with people where you feel like you've been given more to the connection than them. Some of y'all feel like it's a repetitive cycle. Like you keep meeting people who seem like they're putting their all into it. And then you realize that you're the one that's putting them like the, putting the most energy. Why can't I, mo, 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 why can't I get that out? You've been feeling like you're the one. I don't know if this is a specific person. Some of you has been more than one person. Sagittarius, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini here. What is the death card? I feel like your love life has turned you into a different person though. Yeah, you're more, you're healed now. Especially after some type of breakup with the Ten of Cups and the Three of Swords in reverse. It's like you're a completely different cancer with the death. You've been transformed. It's like the old you is dead. There's a new cancer here. I love it. What's the sun in reverse? 
Some of y'all got to be a little bit more optimistic about your love, though. Two of Pentacles in reverse, three of wands. There's somebody you drop. There's somebody you let go of and you're looking forward to the future. This person wasn't making you happy. What's the world? You definitely close out some type of cycle with somebody. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. And you're a lot less stressed since you close out this cycle with this person. Aries energy. A few of you, it could be your child's father, your child's mother. What's the high priestess in reverse? A lot of y'all don't listen to your intuition enough. A lot of you are very intuitive. The devil is here. Some of y'all, your intuition be telling you to like stop, like don't fuck with somebody or to kind of disengage or pull your energy back, whatever. And some of y'all be ignoring your intuition because you got the chariot in reverse, which is your power card. So some of y'all, it's like, you got to trust your intuition more, Cancer. You're very intuitive. You're one of the top intuitive signs. So especially when love, with love, with dating, with the devil here, some of y'all people be having all types of red flags and you'd be like, well, maybe she, and uh, 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 no, she's the devil. Let that bitch go. You know what I'm saying? It'd be a lot of red flags and you'll continue dealing with the person. You got to know when they say, uh-uh, no, my intuition is telling me don't do this. I don't care how good looking you are, how much money you got, how nice your body is, how much you've been calling me, texting me. No, my intuition is telling me something. I got to go with the flow. What's the empress in reverse? Because somebody, baby mama don't like you. Judgment in reverse tried to pop out. Or somebody's mother or somebody's father. The sun in reverse, the two of wands in reverse. Could be a Leo, Taurus, Virgo. I don't know why I said that. Libra. The sun in reverse, the five of cups in reverse. Let me get another card on this. Eight of Swords in reverse, the Emperor. Do you see what I'm saying? Somebody's mother, baby, dad, baby, mama, baby, daddy don't like you. Oh, I, I get why now. So this person feels like you're the reason why their child's father or their child's mother doesn't want to be with them. They feel like you're the reason why the, the mother, the child's mother, the child's father got over them. That's what it is. This is a very specific message, so it's not for all of you, especially if you're not talking to anybody with kids or dealing with anybody that has a child or something like that. But there's somebody, somebody's child's mother or child's father does not like you because they feel like you're the reason why this they don't have a chance with this person anymore. And they're very sad over it. They're very depressed over it. And if it's not somebody's child's mother or child's father... Then it's somebody's parent that don't like you. Like maybe you're talking to a new guy, a new girl, and their parent doesn't like you, specifically the mother. But I feel like the only reason why this mother don't like you is because they don't have any type of control over this child anymore. Maybe they were very controlling. They had a lot of power over this child, but with the eight of swords in reverse, it's like they don't, I mean, I don't know why I'm calling them a child, their, their, their daughter or their son. Weird energy. Somebody's born on the 19th and I'm hearing the name Joyce. Tara's here. What is the temperance? See, you're not listening to your intuition. Judgment in reverse, high priestess in reverse, the king of wands. There's something about you needing to take your time when you're dating people. And listen, to, you got the high priestess in reverse twice. Some of y'all, you have a hard time tapping in. Or even when you do have shit like screaming at you, you may kind of like ignore it. Especially when you're very physically attracted to somebody. You got to work on that. 
What's the Queen of Cups in reverse? Some of y'all been a little bit more emotional lately. Four Wands. I see somebody wanting to invest in you, but I don't feel like you want this person. Because you got the Queen of Cups in reverse, Queen of Pentacles in reverse. I feel like whoever this person is, I feel like you not feeling them like that. But they want to be with you with the Four of Wands. I feel like your primary focus is yourself, especially since a lot of y'all got out of some type of situation with someone. Some of y'all cancers, you got some family members that are, they don't like that you've become a different person, that you're healed and that you've become brand new. I don't get why a family member wouldn't be proud of you for that, but that's what it's also telling me. All right, let's go into the extended now, Cancer. So in the extended, we're going to go ahead and see what's happening in your love life in the future. We'll pull tarot, we'll pull oracle, we'll get you some advice. Do not forget to hit that like button, please, if this reading resonated. Leave me a comment if you feel comfortable. Subscribe, share, tell a friend about Miss Hawaii Tarot. And if you want to book something more specific, if you want a personal reading, you can email MissHawaiiReadings at gmail.com. That'll connect you to my assistant. He's awesome. His name is Pierre. He'll give you all the information that you need to book a session with me, okay? And make sure you guys check me out on Instagram and TikTok. My name on there is Miss Hawaii Tarot. And if you want to become a member of this channel or you would like to check out my astrology Patreon, all that information is in the description box below. All right. So I love you guys. Thank you for tuning in. Thanks for all your love, all your support, all your donations, all your good energy. I'm always praying for you. I'm here if you need me. You keep your head up. You stay positive. And, um... I'll see you guys in the extended. If not, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for your patience and getting you this reading as well. All right. I love you, Cancers. Have a fun weekend. Bye.